Welcome to another episode of Good Cooking. And today we're doing an East Coast treat and my mom's favorite drink, the chocolate egg cream. So this is a drink near and dear to my heart. I used to share these a lot with my mom. And uh, when I was a kid, I would go to a diner with her that was in the neighborhood called Lollipops. And Lollipops was just a little old fashioned diner. And we would go there and we would split a grilled cheese and we would get two of these drinks, chocolate egg creams. And uh, it just brings up a lot of really nice memories with my mom. I had a lot of nice moments with her. She's one of my heroes. And uh, I'm gonna show you how to make this drink. It's pretty simple. It's not found so much here on the West Coast because it's not a thing out here. But on the East Coast, you can walk into any diner and you can find this without a problem. You can find it out here. The waitress in the diner out here is probably like, yeah, I've been out here for 53 years. I was in Brooklyn for 17. I've been a waitress for 79 years. And yeah, I know how to make an egg cream, but you know, most of the time they don't know. So here we go. So we're gonna start off with a little bit of, uh, technically you should be using what's called You Bet Chocolate Syrup. However, they don't got that here. Or maybe they do and I can't find it. <laughs> so we're using good old Hershey's from the Pennsylvania. We're gonna give probably about, uh, you know, diabetes amount. Should we get a little square from my mother? This is the reason why she's not with us anymore. She had too many of these. <laughs> ben, what are you laughing about? That's sad. You're right, that's not funny. <laughs> no! Anyway, mama, don't worry about it. Okay, so now we got the chocolate in there. And then what we're gonna do is very cold milk. We're gonna go about, yeah, that's about good. And you want it very cold because you're not gonna put ice in this because it's gonna dilute it. So don't, you're not putting any ice in it. And then what we're gonna do is you're supposed to take fountain soda but I don't got a fountain machine and they usually sell it in bottle, you know, on the East Coast, you can get somebody to come deliver it with a bottle, it squirts it, it carbonates it and it's really frothy and really nice. But Schweppes is gonna have to do. So here we go. You wanna hear that? You know, like when a truck stops and releases its brakes. Okay, and then we're just gonna pour the rest and then we're gonna mix that bad boy up. How bad would it be to do this with dairy-free milk? So as you can see, we're getting a little bit of froth on top here. You're gonna want more froth, but you know, I don't get the right tools for that. However, that looks really nice. And my mom would always ask for whipped cream. My mom, this is, you know, probably one of her go-tos. Uh, my mom never did drugs, but she did do ready whip. <laughs> she was really wanting the whipped cream, but I think she was doing whippets at one point. So we're just gonna do a little, oh yeah, in honor of beautiful Denise. And then I'm just gonna drizzle a little extra because this is how she used to order it. And then you just put a little straw in there. And there's your little chocolate egg cream. Nice. Should be a little bit more frothy. But I don't got the dolls. And it's just that easy. It's an old school drink and it takes very few ingredients and very little time. And if you don't wanna go to the diner and get yelled at by the 78 year old waitress who's been on the job for 84 years, and just came back from her cigarette break and is annoyed that you sat down at her table, then you can do it at home the way my mom would do it. As always, the recipe is in the description below and from our house to yours, God bless.